So, Thor Ragnarok, Thanksgiving month. Thor, let's talk about Marvel. I liked Iron Man, that was a good start. And for the most part, I haven't liked most of the Marvel films till like around 2014 when they started getting really good again. After they got rid of like the X-Men comic band and stuff from Disney. For the comic books. Thor, I really don't like. Maybe because of Loki. Maybe because of the Thor. Thor isn't likable. He's a little bit charismatic, but otherwise he's ver a very bad role model. Maybe that's why DC always talks about Wonder Woman being such a cool role model. Because Thor is such a terrible role model. He just beats up people, and then everything goes his way. Then again, so is Wonder Woman. Anyway, Thor Ragnarok. I didn't understand any of the movie. I probably would have been more annoyed with, by the Loki plot if it wasn't for the fact that I was already 12 minutes in, where I was already bored, and two, I was annoyed already by the past films on what Marvel fans let Marvel get away with with Loki in terms of trouble character writing, inconsistency, and uh, not having plot holes. Thor's still a douche. His dad died and was killed by his brother. Or Frost Brother Giant. Or Step Brother. Or whatever the heck the Marvel fans want to call them believe he is. And Thor doesn't care what that his sub step sibling or sibling did it. Very good. But whatever. The movie looks really nice. I believe the trailer made it seem like it's going to be David Hasselhoff doing the soundtrack. Which is disappointingly not true. But yeah, again, if you need to watch it, watch it in 3D IMAX. RPX, RPG, VR, Ultra 4K, 4K, or whatever the best format is, film in general. Hope you guys enjoyed. See you later. How does it work on the... How do I finish this on my live stream? This is weird. The 8mm mode on my uh, iPad stream, let me see. Oh, X, sorry.